the real reviews and I got the baton Nick salts like I told you guys I'm gonna do a full review it took me a couple months but I had to try every flavor and give you the seven flavor review and if you guys are interested in Nick salts I've been buying every brand candy kings propaganda days the list goes on and on and I have a variety of salts apple I have the bubble gum I have the uh, the tobacco different flavors and if you guys are interested in tobacco you can't find the right flavor I just bought a bunch of tobacco flavors I've been testing it I'm gonna be doing a review on it please subscribe I'm gonna be doing a bunch of Nick Salt reviews. I just did a review on the Aspire Breeze 2, Aspire Sprite, the Jewel, the Bow Vape. Check out my other videos if you guys are interested. If you're thinking about buying Nick Salts, the different brands, you don't wanna spend the money. I've been in those vape shops. Oh my God, they got 100 different flavors and they're like 15, 20 bucks a piece. I don't, you know, let me spend the money for you. Check out my videos. Any type of Nick Salt you want me to review, I'll be glad to do that and give you a full review after I do that. All right, guys, this is the Baton Nick Salts. And if you haven't seen my Baton refillable pot system review, so the Baton is a great system. Top of the line, very versatile, refillable Nick Salt. And it comes with these pod systems, just like the Jewel, but they're refillable. The coils are amazing. They last a long time. They're high quality. And I would recommend the baton highly and uh, if you can see this right here this is like a matte finish sorry i opened it up the nick salt uh, that's one of the issues you got to clean out the tops i'll show you how to quickly about that top of the pod system it can leak sometimes but i'm going to be doing that in my review on my baton all right so there's seven different flavors. They're 10 milliliters each. These are the bottles it comes with. They're small. They're very easy to throw in a bag and bring with you. Here is the tip of it. Very easy to pour in. Great for refillable pot systems. And this, these don't only work with the baton system. These work with any system you have. All right, guys, so let me kind of get into it. Baton is a great company, um, and I've been trying to get away from the Jewel. The pods are very expensive, and I kept buying it, and I couldn't find a system that I liked where I can refill a pod. Baton is the best. Um, they have to kind of figure out a better way with the pod systems. I'll show you the little rubber piece on top when you refill it, but they don't ever leak like this. This has been sitting, I've been testing a couple units uh, for about, this has been sitting for about a week because I've tested every flavor. They have seven flavors. These are at 5% and they have 2.5%. So the 5% is actually very smooth, but if you wanna decrease your nicotine intake, I would definitely recommend the 2.5%. They have the Fruit Confet, which is right here. They have the Glacier Mint. They have the Island Mango. They have the Southern Leaf. They have the Crisp Apple. They have the Vanilla Wafer. And my personal favorite, the Ice Watermelon Limeade. And I'm gonna kinda go over every flavor. So the Fruit Confet, um, it's not my top choice. I did not really like it. It's got a weird aftertaste to it. It's, it's kind of like a fruit medley, uh, very mixed in, um, not very sweet, very kind of on an average point. I would give it, um, I would say a 2.5 out of 5. The Glacier Mint is great. Very, um, how do I put it? Not spearmint. Like it says, a glacier mint, very uh, kind of cool mint. Uh, the flavor is consistent. If you like something mellow, you might like the glacier mint. I give that a 3.5 out of 5. The island mango is amazing. Very great taste. That mango taste that you love. And it's very consistent as well. Would recommend that. That's a 4 out of 5. The southern leaf tastes like a blend between uh, tobacco and a cigar, kind of uh, 
like it says, the Southern Leaf. And um, it's not bad for uh, tobacco flavor, way better than the caramel flavors I taste on all the other uh, Nick salts. Great uh, Southern Leaf, I give it a, a 3.8 out of 5. The crisp apple, great aftertaste. I taste that apple, very crisp, very smooth, very mellow. Give that a th uh, 4 out of 5. The vanilla wafer, very great vanilla taste, very mellow. Give that a 3.5 out of 5. The iced watermelon limeade, that was my first flavor and my favorite flavor. Very, very great flavor. It's got that lime uh, tanginess. The watermelon tastes great. And, um, you know, this is a 5%. I would definitely recommend going to the 2.5%. Uh, you get a little bit more flavor out of those. Um, these are the refillable pods that come with it. To refill it, it's not from the bottom. It's actually, you pull the top off. And this is their patented patented uh, uh, top. This is the rubber piece that collects all the excess Nick salt. So you would uh, have to clean this off every once in a while. To um, fill this up, you just lift this uh, rubber piece on one side, or you can lift both of them and refill it. Usually it's recommended to lift both of them so air comes out of one side. And to put it back on, you just put this rubber piece, and that's where you saw that Nick Salt come out of the baton, is because it sits in this rubber piece, and it will flow down sometimes. And that stops it from coming up into your mouth. And it's a great piece. You just take off that rubber piece, uh, kind of smush it into a piece of napkin, and it sucks in all the Nick Salt. The baton is a really great system. Very high tech. The uh, the colors do change. Sometimes it gives you a rainbow color and tells you when you're getting a great hit. Um, and I would recommend them definitely. Some flavors I like, some I don't. Definitely recommend the Island Mango, the Southern Leaf, and the Ice Watermelon Limeade. I would try them all, see where your flavor uh, variety hits a little bit. The fruit confet's not my favorite. Glacier mint's all right. It's very mellow. Um, I kind of like a little bit more spearmint in my mint, but that's your call. All right, guys. Um, I give the baton on quality a 5 out of 5. They have very consistent flavoring. Um, the bottles are 10 milliliters. They're a little bit small. The tip of it fits great into any Nick Salt pod system. So any refillable pod system, you don't have to use it on the Baton. You can use it on the Aspire or any other different brands you can find. So in your sense, the 5% uh, percent is smooth, but I would definitely recommend the 2.5% if you like a smoother hit. Great brand, great flavors. Um, I'm definitely excited to see more flavors out of Baton. The company is great, customer service is great, and um, I would definitely recommend them. Check out my video on the full review on the baton, on the unboxing, and I have more videos to come on all different types of Nick Salts. If you're looking at apple variety, tobacco variety, um, different brands in general, and which ones I like and dislike, and I'll tell you exactly how they taste. All right, guys, thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. This is the Baton Nick Salt Review. All right, coming next time is more flavors for you guys. Thanks so much.